Howard University, known for its pristine landscape and closely knitted students, was defaced Tuesday morning with chalk and graffiti remarks about Dr. Wayne A.I. Frederick, president of the university. The illustrations were in response to President Frederick's private meeting with the new Secretary of Education, Betsy DeVos, and were publicized just hours before President Trump's HBCU executive order meeting. Student Ambassador Monet Thomas shared her concerns about how the vandalism would affect upcoming campus tours. It's like how parents would react, how the students would react. I saw it yesterday and a lot of the ambassadors that had to give tours yesterday were also very nervous because no one knew how to address those questions. Here on the yard is where the plantation overseer remarks were painted. The graffiti was removed yesterday morning, just in time to not sabotage the accepted students' tour. You could kind of see some writing, but for the most part it was washed out. And I could see the parents and the kids looking like, what did that say? But I don't think they could really tell because they didn't ask me anything. But had I gotten a question about it, I would have just said, you know, Howard students are very passionate. We're known for protesting, having dissent. But I do draw the line, I think, when it comes to vandalizing our own property. Calvin Hatley poses an alternative. We're creating um, HU Safe Space, right, which is an online platform where people can just share whatever ideas they have. I'm then going to compile that as student ombudsman, and then we're going to start to talk about that as a community. For News Vision, I'm Tyra Trent.